that ready to come. Lip gloss, shine and tattoos on the back. Attitude, right? Mary J mixed with black. <laughs> Oh. I'm gonna fight today. <laughs> oh, I see things I can go to Target. No, I'm going to Walmart. No, come on, baby. Target. Target have the cutest stuff. you guys welcome back to another vlog today has been pretty eventful to say the least today is Wednesday September the 13th yeah September the 13th we've been out and about early this morning early this morning uh, took my daughter to school then went and got breakfast, let the kids play at Chick-fil-A for a little bit before my son's doctor's appointment. That, what, what is the problem, son? Thank you, you too. What are you doing, where's your chicken nuggets? Hold on, son, we're gonna get your chicken nuggets. Alrighty, thank you. These kids act like I did not feed them, but they didn't want to eat. Uh oh, they wouldn't eat their um. They wouldn't eat their food that I bought them at uh Chick Fil A. Like they wouldn't, they wouldn't eat it. I was like, I got it, son. I got it. So, anyways, like I was saying, so we got up this morning, took my daughter to school, we went to Chick-fil-A, got breakfast, and I let them play in the playhouse for just a little bit. We was there for a little bit just to kill some time. Um, we went to his pulmonologist appointment, which was very insightful. Um, what they say he may have crud, crude something like that crude um just based off of the things that we were telling that i was telling him that he's experienced so they gave us an action plan changed up his medications so we're going to go back in six weeks to see if that regimen is working for him so hopefully it does and we don't have any issues and he just gets better um, they are going to check they want to get the information from his asthma uh, clinic they don't want to do blood draw because um, I don't know if you if if you new here then um, of course you don't know but if you aren't new to my channel you know that my son is autistic um, he is high functioning um, his issue with doctors is touch he has gotten better to a certain extent but it's like certain procedures he's just not you're not touching him not touching him so um, they weren't able to look to check his tonsils they weren't able to check his throat today he just was not having it um, <clears throat> So they're gonna get all of the information from the asthma and allergy specialist from when he did the allergy testing just to see what his allergens are and then uh, go from there. So hopefully they can get what they need, but I really do feel that the best route is to do a blood work for him 
simply for because they can get all of the data and narrow it down to what is triggering for him because we've been in and out of the emergency room since December of 22 like that's a lot for a three-year-old so even though he said that it's normal for toddlers to have upper respiratory issues 10 to 12 times a year and I'm like what like come on that goodness I know kids get sick but like this where we have to go to the emergency room no I don't think that's normal that that you cannot tell me that that's normal so um we're just gonna see how this regimen does for him hopefully it it works and you know we don't have to do any drastic measures um he has had two ear infections back to back within the last um, two months so that's another issue his snoring is an issue so we're just trying to see and make sure that um, if he would need a sleep study if he would need surgery we don't know so we'll see and then they don't want to do surgery because he's three and I'm like he's about to be four next month if he does need surgery we're about to go ahead and get the surgery so my son can you know be good so that's all that update with the doctors so now we are headed to um, North Dallas have a couple of errands to run so our first stop in North Dallas is the is my attorney's office um, I had an accident back in December literally leaving the hospital with one of the kids with my oldest daughter she was having issues with her asthma and we were leaving children's and headed to go get her prescription and right when we were headed there somebody rear-ended us totaled out our car that was horrible and uh, so I have to go see the attorney for our settlement um, for my settlement we just received my daughter's settlement last week but my settlement was too much to be uh, mailing so I have to physically go and pick that up and then the next thing is um, then I need to stop by um, a brand showroom so one of the brands that I was going to be collaborating with here in Dallas well I mean they're not a Dallas brand but they have a showroom here in Dallas so I need to go back to their I need to go to their showroom and return the stroller that I was uh, partnering with them with because my son is too big for the stroller like his legs just do not cooperate with that particular stroller and they drag so like if I'm gonna partner I want to represent the brands that I love to the fullest because I want to have that rapport with them I want to continue working with them and I just could not in good conscience fake the content I could not do that and I would refuse to do that and I would hope that no one else is doing that just to have a brand partnership and I'm like no um, so I emailed the coordinator and let her know that hey love the concept of the double stroller but my son just he does not fit he's too tall for it like his feet was literally dragging on the ground and I tripped over his feet and almost fell pushing the stroller I was like oh no no this is not gonna work and I tried on multiple occasions just to see um, if it was just me or if it was just you know him clowning around but no it's just not working but I love the concept of it really do love the concept of it so I'm hoping that I can get a different stroller um, because we do need a double stroller we definitely need a double stroller we have one but the one that I have is so bulky and heavy and 
it's just ridiculous I should have just waited and saved my money to get the actual stroller that I wanted which is this brand that I you know uh, trying to do a collaboration with so oh now it's raining even more raining even more yeah so I should have just saved my money because the original stroller double stroller that I wanted was like $500 dollars and then I opted to get something that was like half the price with another brand but I like so regret it because it is it is a pain to get around like it's not it's very heavy it's it's narrow enough like it's not like I can't navigate it but it's really extremely heavy and I'm like oh my goodness and then now my son the front of it once again his little legs is so long it's it is just so that stroller just didn't work out for us either so I said I was either gonna sell it or do a giveaway because that stroller is still in immaculate uh, condition like <laughs> we barely used it because it was such a pain such a pain so I may do a big uh, a giveaway for that and give it to uh, a mom that needs a double stroller uh, here in Dallas because I can only imagine what shipping would cost if it's somebody else oh, I don't even want to I don't even want to know what shipping cost of that double stroller would be um, But yeah, so I'm I think I might do that I think I might do that clean it up really good and actually give it away because I'm a big giver I'm always giving away um, items that I can't use anymore I never resell my baby stuff. I always give it away to somebody that can use it. I was like, well, at least my money is, you know, get my money's worth. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do that. And then after that, hopefully, we'll just go back home and chill for a little bit and then go get my daughter. But I think we're gonna just stay out, to be perfectly honest, instead of going back and forth. Um, I do need to go and pick up What's going on, son? It's right here. What's right here? Yeah, it's right here. Um, there's more, son. Hold on. There was more. Here. Thank you. You're welcome. That fell out of your bag. Yeah, so, um, I'm thinking because my husband is already at home. He's asleep. He, this week has been tremendous. He's been getting off super early. Um, so he's in the bed sleeping. So I, with them being home, us being home early, huh, I don't want to disturb him during the day. <laughs> he's getting his rest. He works at night. Um, cause he gets up when we're getting ready to go to bed. So we just, that's how we see each other in passing during the week. It's not ideal, but it's gonna get better it's gonna be get better um but yeah so y'all just come with us uh it's more of like a life update vlog today and then oh that was the other place i need to go um since i've been substituting as a kinder uh aid oh my goodness i am learning so much of what my son will need before he starts kindergarten is like an eye-opener it's like what the world so um i've been telling my husband about stuff and we was like man we feel like some bad parents around here because we 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 slacking like they are not playing in kindergarten when i say they are not playing they are not playing so i'm going to i've been pricing some stuff on amazon and i was just going to do like this really big amazon haul and get all of the stuff that I need that I know that I need to do to help prepare him so he won't be so behind when he starts kinder but um, I'm going I want to go to the teacher store my favorite teacher store out here it's a really neat educational store love them I've always gone to their store so I'm gonna go check them out to see if they have some stuff and if um, if I don't have to order it and I can go ahead and get it and we can start working on it, then I'm gonna do that. Uh, but if it's cheaper on Amazon, then I'm just gonna get it from Amazon and call it a day. Call it a day. 
so yeah so y'all just gonna come along with us we're gonna make these two stops out here in north dallas uh first my attorney's office then to the brand and then we'll see what time it is by the time we finish and go from there so Okay, so we just made it to my attorney's office, so I'm about to go in, grab uh, my settlement, and then head over to, oh, I need to see where, where the brand showroom is from here. Yeah, I need to, I probably should have did that. Well, since I'm parked here, let's see. Okay, so I'm already here. Let's see. That is. Yeah! I'm going up to see this. Everybody buy. Two. Okay. Is it further? Wait. Mommy, I won't get out. Yeah. I know, son. We're only going to get out for just a second. So it looks like it's going back. So, hmm. Leaving and coming down. Okay, cool. So, okay, literally. Okay, that was smart. So I came here first to my attorney's office because I was not thinking about, hey, let me check to see the distance between the two. So I literally passed the brand's showroom getting here. So this was further out, so that's good. Okay, so just made it to my attorney's office to grab my settlement. Then we're gonna go to there. Hopefully we can switch out stuff. I don't know what they have in the showroom. I don't know what she wants to do. Um, so stop there, go by the bank, because I do not need all that money on my hands. And we're gonna go from there because these little ones it's past their nap time say yeah yeah mm -hmm. Brindley it's past your nap time uh -huh. <laughs> your nap time yeah that's your nap time I know nap Back time car. we got our settlement and it's time to go Let's head over to the brand showroom. Then I need to go to the bank because that needs to be cashed and deposited ASAP. ASAP. And then, yeah, we're just gonna see where we are from there because it's already 1237 and it's already telling me that it's gonna take 30 minutes. So it's not gonna take until after one o'clock to get to the showroom. Yeah, it's going to take after one just to get to the showroom. 
So, and I told them that I would be there anywhere between noon and three. You need a drink? Here's your water. Here's your water. Yeah, so, yeah, I don't know. May not be able to do much today. May have to wait and do a little bit on Friday since daycare is out on Friday. So that means I will not be able to do an assignment on Friday. So yeah, I might have to hold off and do my other little errands on Friday instead of trying to do everything today. But I really wanted to do something like fun Friday. Not necessarily be doing any errands, but it's a Friday. Be laid back and chill type mood. So I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. As long as says we're not going to get there until like a little after 1 o'clock. But I really don't want to go home. And then have to get right back out to pick my daughter up from school. And that's my only thing. Don't want to go back home. Get them settled. Get them right back out. I'd rather just stay out. Get gas. Let them sleep in a car type deal. Oh, I'm just sitting here. Like I can't turn right on red. Mercy. Because I'm too busy trying to think. Yeah. I think that's what I'm going to do. We're just going to stay out. Get more gas. Before this sucker get on E at some point. Because all this ripping and running. It's going to get there. Alright. So I have made it downtown. And hopefully... I can park right here because where I'm parked is it's kind of sketch. It's kind of sketch over here. <laughs> it's a little weird, but I just arrived, so hopefully um, I could just ring, ring that, and return the stroller. And then they decided to fall asleep on me. They couldn't make it. Neither one of them could make it. So. So I'm gonna keep the car running and because it's literally like right there, like right there. So I ain't gotta walk too far. So I'm just gonna get out, ring the doorbell, see if somebody will answer, give them the stroller and stuff, and see if they will give me something different. That would be lovely. So I could still park it with them, but we shall see.
And that was a quick drop off. I was not expecting it to be that quick, but uh, she was already on the phone when I got there. Um, so yeah, not sure. So if it's meant to, oh goodness. Let me see. Yeah, so she was on the phone, like she answers the door on the phone. Um, but if it's meant to be to work with this brand, um, hopefully she'll give me a call back or give me a call, email me so that uh, we can coordinate and uh, still do a collaboration with a stroller or equipment that works for our family. Um, now, it, yeah, especially now that I know where the showroom is. Because this is literally not far from my house. Like, this is not far at all. So, the kids are asleep. <sighs> I'm trying to debate on if I should go home. And let them just get their nap out. I just hate to turn. I would hate to turn around. Because I have to leave the house at the... Mm. Well, no, they can still get their nap out. Because we can make it home by 1.30. No later than 1.40. 1.30. Give it a good 15 minutes. So they can still get a good nap in. Leave the house about... Yeah. I think that's what I'm going to do. Just go ahead and let them get their sleep because cranky toddlers is not what you want. You just don't want no cranky toddlers. Not when you got when you can prevent it. Goodness. So yeah. I guess we're gonna just head on home and then we'll get back out when it's time to get my daughter from school. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. Alright y'all, so I did not go home. Did not go home because I was looking at the time and I was like, yo, I still need, and I forgot. I was like, I still gotta cash this check. I forgot all about that, so I still need to do that. So I did that. I'm gonna go ahead and pick my daughter up early from school because it's now two o'clock and we're already out here. So I'm not gonna go back, go get her, like trying to kill another two hours because she gets out at 4.15. Not gonna try to kill another two hours of uh, time. Hey, Bobby, that's plastic. We get sissy here. Yeah, we're gonna get sissy. Oh, Bobby, what is that? We're gonna come in sissy school. We're gonna go in sissy school, okay? Yeah, this is sissy school. Uh -huh. I want my tablet. Uh, your tablet is at home. So, oh. Oh, it was on the charger, too. Mommy, it's right. Mommy, does sissy, does sissy to school. Yeah, sissy school. Come on, let's go in and go, go get sissy, okay? You happy to be out of school early? Yes, yeah. it's 2:40. It's 2:40. I'm out of school, I, and I don't get out to push for tea. I know. They're the only school that has that. It's not fair. Kevin and them get out at 3:55. They get out when I'm in gym. Each school has to get out at a different time because of the buses. So okay. that's how it works. So like, high school goes first, then elementary. No, ma'am. That's yep. So we are done. I got all the money off of me. I don't like <laughs> having that much money on me. Well, I seen it. It was, it was looking at me. It was like, Elena, pick me up. <laughs> I was like, Elena, Elena. <laughs> and it just left me. Well, except, for, except for what you have. Mm. It's still looking at me. It, it can keep looking at you. And it's all the across the street. I bet it is. <laughs> oh. Bet it is. Yes, so I am done with my errands. The important 
errands because mercy that was important I did not like that I was nervous the entire time and then it didn't help when I was at the attorney's office and the lady was like be uh, be extra cautious of, uh, of your surroundings put this in your purse right now and hurry up and get to your car with your babies um, because she said she had they had a client that was attacked and they took oh, their money I would have been scared to walk out I was terrified. I was so scared. So, yeah. And you know, I get so I was like, I, I mean, want to hurry up, get to the bank, cash it, and then hurry up and get here and deposit it. Like, it was just too much money. I don't like it. Uh, but let's go get something to eat. And then it's 2.40. I was going to go to the S-T-O-R-E, but I don't know if we should go. Yes, 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 yes. S-T-O-R-E. I just wait until Friday. No, like that AI girl. She's like, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> what? The AI girl, pinky it off. Yes, she got, yeah. Yes, she, yes. No, she will not be doing that. She'll be like, gang, 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 gang. <laughs> no, I just how I be saying people she, doing something. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes, yes. She got a song yes. called Ice Cream yes. So Good. All right, well, come on. Oh, it was almost a fight today. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> What's up you guys? Today is Friday. I do not have work today. It is Friday, September the 15th. Um, yeah, yesterday I had to go into work. So, wait, Wednesday, that's where I left off with the vlog. Thursday, I had to go into work. Was not trying to even try to vlog. <sighs> well, I'm in the school setting, so I can't vlog throughout the day. But today, Friday, the kids are out of daycare. And so we're home. And... There's the never ending pile of laundry that needs to be done. Um, it all goes straight to the crib, the unused crib. So, um, yeah. So I'm gonna try to get some of this laundry done. Keyword T R Y. Um, I have some errands that I want to do today, not necessarily have to do today but I do want to run some errands um first the one that I do need to do is go pick up my son's new medication from when we went to the doctors on Wednesday um they're changing one medication completely and then the other ones they're just changing dosage um and then I want to go to the education store the teacher store uh, because I will be homeschooling my son so I need to get a lot of things that I need for him because we're on the fence about letting him do daycare I mean daycare kinder next year which wait he can't do kinder next year no way he can only do pre-k four next year yeah because you have to be five to be in kinder okay so I'm way ahead of myself good but um yeah the way education is going right now we don't think he's going to go to pre-k or kinder so we don't know so i'm just going to teach him everything that he needs to know so when he does start school he's good who is honey boo <laughs> i will turn the camera but you kind of have nikki <laughs> what's wrong babe nothing at all what you gonna do well, can I buy him a little backpack? Yeah, we're we, we going yeah, we to get something. Uh, okay, well, that means I can go to Target. No, I'm going to Walmart. No, come on, baby. Target. Target have the cutest stuff. I ain't got no money. Oh, really? But we got money for something else tomorrow. Bruh. Huh? I just need to hear it there. Let's make a deal. Let's let's make a deal. What what can I bargain for? What you to bargain for? Huh? I said what you trying to bargain. I wanna go to I wanna go to Target. So what's in it for me? Huh? What's in it for me? Some nice fun. Some really nice fun. 